was just Tom coming back from the game. I think Coach Baldwin talked about it being a tough emotional loss. What kind of was the mood among everyone? Um, I mean, obviously, we're disappointed after a tough loss like that. Um, but I mean, we're, we're also excited for the next week. You know, we're, we're ready to move on from that, uh, learn from learn from what we did wrong, and, and continue to continue to get better. When you're looking back at the tape at some of those interceptions, what do you see when you're looking at them? Um, I just see. Um, to see improvements that need to be made. You know, I, I think there there were times where um, I did make great decisions, and there were also times where uh, there's uh, little physical errors. But it's all things that we can continue to get better on, and continue to get timing down with our receivers and the quarterback and the running backs. And, and as we continue to build and continue to work as a as a group and as a unit, then we're gonna continue to get better. Last. <laughs> Say, last, same question. Last year it was UCLA that took that sixth win from you guys at the end of the season. Does this kind of stand out a little bit more, knowing that this is the team you know that you guys had last little bad taste in your mouth from last season? Oh, I mean, I think every game's important. I think I think the way you attack every game and the way you attack every day should be should be exactly the same. So, um, I mean, we're really focused on ourselves. We're focused on continuing to get better and and uh, continue to fix the things and, and the problems that we have uh, and, and, you know, just get smoother, continue to stay in rhythm, continue to put up points and, and you know, go out and get a win this week. Was there anything to you that felt very different from the first half and the second half, just from a personal standpoint? Um, no, not, not really. I just think uh, we, we had to find a way to finish in the second half. I think in the first half we did a good job finding a way to get the ball in the end zone and, and, and not make the mistakes. But in the second half we started to build on a, a couple of mistakes and, and uh, I guess the momentum slows down a little bit and it, it just wasn't as smooth as, we, as it should have been. But. Is it nice to come back home after a tough loss like that and play in front of your yeah. family? Yeah, it's awesome. I mean, it, it's also it's always good to be around our fans and, and to play in our home stadium. Um, it's a great environment, and um, I mean, it's always exciting, especially in a big game like UCLA. We can uh, play another California team and be at home. It's, it's a great opportunity. Are you kind of being indoctrinated into the Cal UCLA rivalry a little bit, feeling it a little? Bit yeah, more? yeah, oh yeah. I'm, I'm excited for it. I mean, to be honest, I haven't been able to play in a game like this, but. Um, Man, I'm, I'm excited. I've seen, seen both of these teams play growing up, and, and I've gotten to learn even more as I, as I uh, have, have been here and been at the school, so I'm very excited for the game. Are you excited for the Joe Roth uniforms? Yeah. It's always a thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're nice. You get to wear the white cleats, and, and, and the uniforms were awesome, too. It's always cool to switch it up and put some cool uniforms on. How long do the white cleats stay white? Oh, not too long. Yeah. You, start, you, start, yeah, you start practicing, you start, they start getting scuffed up and everything, but I mean, they're going to look good, though. What have you seen in the early going from the UCLA defense? Uh, I mean, they're they're a tough defense. Uh, they they play hard and um, I mean a lot of man coverage. And, and they're, they're also getting to their zone stuff too. But they got a lot of athletes. You know, they they have a lot of people on the field that that can make plays. And uh, we're gonna have to continue to just keep playing smart, keep con controlling the ball, and taking care of the ball, and just make the plays like we did. Do you see any similarities with Coach Az coming from here last year to going down there? Yeah, for sure. I mean, having, having Coach Az as their defensive coordinator now, he, uh, I mean, we see a lot of similarities. There's a lot of things that, that I mean, we, we see every day, but there's there's also a lot of differences because now he's he's uh, he's doing some different things, and uh, we just we just continue to look at the stuff, and it's it's great that we're able to practice against our defense and get a great look at, at, at uh, a lot of things that they're familiar with. Um, but yeah, there, there are a lot of similarities, but also also some different things in our defense. Good. All right, thanks. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.